Welcome back to Don's Life. Welcome to the channel. Today we've got our first battery powered cordless lawnmower. So let's unbox it. We got our battery charger here. We'll have to charge that battery right away. We've got our bag. This is probably our battery. All right, first things first, we gotta get this battery charged before we try this thing out. So it looks pretty simple. Keep the battery like that. Slide that over top and this is your release button later. And it tells you all the different states of charging right here on the label. So it should be pretty straightforward. On the back here, we've got these LED indicators showing the charging progress. And like a lot of lithium ion tool batteries these days, you push that button when it's not on the charger and it'll tell you it's charge state. So we'll give that uh, probably a couple hours, I think. And then we should be good to try out this mower. All right, looks like this wire bracket just slips in the bag like so. But you just gotta loop these plastic pieces around the metal bar. All right, let's try to figure out some of these features together. So this has a single point height adjustment. So we can lift it up like that and get into the highest mode, up to four inches, down to one and a half inches. That's pretty neat, we'll just put it right there. One of the reasons I'm doing this is this gas Craftsman ore is probably about 15 years old. The carburetor needs a rebuild. Um, I'm sure somebody would like to tinker with it. I'm done. Uh, and we only have 600 square feet of grass over there. So I thought going electric might be interesting. So I chose this one here. It seemed like it was a pretty good deal. Um, it came with a really big lithium ion battery, the six amp hour battery, which on its own is half the price of the mower. So what does that tell you? Um, this one here is a 20 inch, this is a 21 inch. This one here is also brushless, which means it's gonna be a little more energy efficient, not have to work as hard to spin the motor. Let's have a look underneath. I haven't looked under there yet. But there's your electric lawnmower. Pretty straightforward. Uh, it's a plastic cavity, which surprises me. It's uh, the whole construction of this, other than some of the frame bracing is plastic so you know you can spend twice as much on electric wireless cordless mower but uh for that little bit of grass that i have i just need this thing to last you know the next four or five years and we'll be golden okay let's look at a couple more features so first off to use it you have to undo these locks and pull the handle all the way up and then relock it but if you want to see something really cool fold that back down pop these out Lock them back in. Voila, you have to store it that way. So super easy, minimal storage, small footprint. Lay it back down. Pop these open. Bring it back, pop them back. We're ready to roll. Now back here, we have the mulch plug. This just pops out like this. So this is in multi-mode right now. You pop that out. And now the grass can flow at the back. And it's got a nice single pull bag. You just drop it in place. Super easy to lift up. Drop in place, lift up, drop in place. Really easy. Okay, we got our battery charged. Let's put it in. So that goes right here. You see this little slot? 
just like that. This is a spot for an extra battery, but I don't have an extra battery, so I don't like it being empty. I'm gonna put a little guy up here, go for a little ride. I wanna share this experience. Now this key needs to be put in here to make this work, and it comes shipped in here. I just took it out so you could see that for demonstration purposes. We'll put our top down, but before we go, probably the most satisfying part, And there's one on this side too that I get to enjoy all by myself. Hey, okay, this is called your bale right here. So first we'll get our handle up, lock it back down. This has to be down and then there's a start button here. Now if you let go of the bale, it automatically shuts off. Now we've had two rains while they've been charging the batteries, so the grass is a little bit wet. Maybe this will be a good test. We got the lawn mowed, 600 square feet, couple passes. Let's see how much battery we have left. We used one bar, so I should be able to get four mows out of this battery, probably more, it's hard to say. But uh, it's kind of weird using a cordless uh, electric lawn mower because it, when it went over some thicker grass where it got much wetter or it just grew in a lot thicker, the motor would throttle up all by itself, so it must have a sensor to figure out when it's uh, easy work and hard work and try and keep it consistent. So anyway, I'm just going to put it to bed now, and I hope you enjoyed the video. This is uh, more Don's life, just do-it-yourself, but yard work. So hit that like button, consider subscribing. We'll talk to you next time.